official resale site for the team's ticket. Well, Top Size Matt King explains what the change means for fans. It makes life easy. No more tickets to this. It's easier. You have control. You have access. It's, it's portable. So I just use like on the phone, like the app to scan. Very rarely do I print something out. Most fans uh, prefer mobile. Overwhelming uh, prefer mobile. Uh, print at home is kind of obsolete. Uh, a lot of people don't even have printers. Fans at the stadium Monday evening supported Yankees president Randy Levine's comments on the present and future of mobile ticketing at a news conference earlier in the day in which Levine and StubHub president Scott Cutler announced what they called an extraordinarily complex six-year deal worth a reported $100 million that makes StubHub the Yankees' official fan-to-fan -fan ticket reseller. It makes no difference. Now, the average fan may feel this way. Which mobile app one uses to buy a ticket matters less than the validity and price of said ticket. But the finer print of this agreement establishes a cheapest price at which a fan can sell a Yankees ticket on StubHub, around 50% of the ticket's face value in a full season plan. Starting this season, the Yankees stopped accepting tickets fans printed out at home. This forced fans looking to buy tickets from other fans to do so far enough in advance to receive a physical ticket through the mail or to buy a digital ticket through the Yankees Ticket Exchange, operated by Ticketmaster. All of the features uh, that we have put into Yankee Ticket Exchange will be in effect transferred over uh, and utilized by StubHub and, and improved. Just had an issue today with Ticketmaster and trying to get my ticket to transfer and hopefully StubHub uh, works better for us. StubHub officially takes over Yankees fan-to-fan -fan ticket sales on July 15th. The deal also makes StubHub what we being called a major marketing and sponsorship partner of the New York Yankees. And with the stadium, I'm Matt King, Fox Valley.